Hey, I'm Lori from Here by Lori. I'm here with Grace today. Say hi. Hi. Today we have a very fun Halloween hairstyle for you. It is this elastic spider web hairstyle, perfect for short hair like Gracie, but you could use it on long hair too. Let's get started. Okay, so I've started by brushing her hair out and I am going to wet her hair down. It's a little easier to work with when you do it that way. There we go. You're spraying me. <laughs> I'm spraying you. So now that I've wet her hair down, I'm gonna come along with my rat tail comb. It's my favorite for parting hair because it gives you the nice clean part lines. So I'm gonna come and part it along here. So I've parted her hair now. This side's just gonna end up hanging down and this side we're gonna do our style on. So I'm going to just secure this side in like a little ponytail temporarily out of the way just so that it's easier to not pick up any of this hair as we go along. And I am gonna start, I'm gonna work my spider web going back kind of at an angle here. So I'm going to make it part on an angle. Part off a section of hair here. And secure it with an elastic. Okay, so now that I've got this ponytail here, I'm just gonna let it fall to the side there. I'm going to create another part line going diagonal behind that first one. And I'm going to split it in two. We're going to have two sections. This one I'm going to clip off temporarily. Don't lose it. Okay, so from this first ponytail here, I'm going to split it in two and half of the hair I'm gonna now secure with this section. Unclip that section and take that other half from that first ponytail and secure it together. All right, so we've got our two little ponytails. We're gonna make another row here and we're just gonna keep going. So this row is gonna have three, the next is gonna have four. So set those out of the way and then come along and we'll do another uh, part line parallel with the other two. Okay, and then when I look to part back, I just go to the middle of whatever section I'm parting behind. So. I'll part that one straight back. And then this, I'm just gonna secure out of the way. Is purple and pink are your favorite? Oh yes. <laughs> Take half of the hair from this ponytail and secure it in with this section. Unclip this. As we're looking at it, we want to come middle of this one part back. Okay, secure this little bit out of the way. And I'm going to take the half the hair from this one and half of the hair from this one. Okay, so I finished that row out. Again, we're just gonna part. One more row going back. We will continue what we've been doing with taking the little sections and taking half the hair from each of these ponytails as we go into them. I'm doing my last section here, and then I just have this one little section from this ponytail. I'm going to secure in an elastic here, 
and then we are done. It's quick, it's easy, and it works great for any length hair. Um, I know it's kind of hard once you cut their hair, like we cut Gracie's um, so recently, and it, it can be challenging to think, what can I do with their hair? And especially for the holidays, you still wanna be able to do fun hairstyles. So um, this is fun for Halloween. Though I'll be honest with you, this technique can work um, for any time of the year. You can use fun colored elastics, match their uh, outfits, um, and use this technique. You could you know, start at the front of the head and kind of go all the way out. But for a little spider web, I think this is fun. Just a cute little accent over here. So I picked up these little plastic spider rings. I'm sure you've seen them this time of the year. They're like party favors. Um, so super inexpensive and easy to use. Or I've also found these very sparkly um, spiders from our local craft store. So these ones are gonna be a little bit harder to secure. Um, I recently saw, I believe it's, I'm not gonna say it right, but I saw some glue that's specifically made that you can use to tack things onto hair or skin and washes out. That would be fantastic to use. I don't have any, so I'm just gonna, if I use one of these, I could lift up one of these um, elastics and secure it like that. But I'm just gonna show you with these plastic rings since these are so readily available. What I find works best for me is if I take the ring and I kind of push it together there. Like so, gently so it doesn't break. And just kind of mold it. So it's not gonna stick up off her head so much. So just gently do that. And then take it and wherever you wanna put it in your spider web, just open it again and gently push it back together. And there you have it, a super cute, very easy uh, hairstyle that works for any hair length. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching today's tutorial. I hope if you try it at home that it turns out great for you. If you try it and want to share a photo, I would love to see. You can post it on my Facebook page, or if you share it on Instagram, tag me at Hair by Lori. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Come subscribe to our channel. Subscribe to our channel. <laughs> Thanks, guys, for watching. See you next week.